is like you are telling me you are walking in River Road. Then a policeman catches you with a roll of bangi. Then you tell the policeman, why have you... So it's an irrelevant question. But then, <laughs> but then let me answer you on that. Uh, crime does not expire. The message we are passing to the public here is that we are overwhelmed with the number of cases that we are investigating. We did not start investigating Wairia and the attorney in the last, yesterday. yesterday or six months ago. We started it long ago. Even when he was a CS uh, Treasury, we were still investigating him on issues when he was a governor. Now, the things that are now ripe, we have all the evidence that when we lock on them, they'll have a case to answer, is when we arrested them. So, there is nothing like, and this is a message, that the current governors, but pole pole will get hold of you. So, it's a message. And the issue of saying uh, it's political, you know, that is the song of politicians. When, they are, when, you arrest, when you arrest a policeman, there's a famous Twitter handler who will say, these guys just go for small fishes and uh, petty, petty cases. The way the chairman has said, when we go for politicians, mumetumwa. When you arrest somebody who is in the government, you have been bought by the opposition. When you go for somebody in the opposition, you have been bought by the government. So this, this is common noise we are used to. But you see, there's a famous saying that uh, if you want to reach your destination, don't, don't get engaged with barking dogs. Because you'll, never, you'll be busy kicking these dogs and you'll never reach your destination. So you ignore. They make the noise and uh, we, arrest we arrest them. And then uh, yesterday, the, the noise they made, one of the person, the lawyer there is a governor. His, gov his, his county, we have even focused, it is on uh, our red flag. So you can tell that, that uh, lawyer come governor, we may end up in his place very soon.